Welcome back, today we are taking a look into PayPal ticker's symbol PYPL. First we'll check the weekly chart. So by December of 2021 the stock dropped to the lows of $108 per share where we set our third support price target. It kept on trading there for 6 weeks but in the second week of January of this year the price went under our support and in 2 more weeks went lower for the 200 day moving average. We got a green candle there so the moving average did act as a support as the price started the bounce back up. But this week PayPal reported earnings and the price did drop over 20% after those. Both the relative strength index and the MACD are now increasingly bearish. Just to get additional perspective I now added this red line which is the 300 d moving average. It appears that we are now really close to it which is at $122 per share. So this could be another support that we are looking for. Now let's change for the daily chart. Last week the stock dropped to the lows of $152.08 per share with the relative strength index going under 30 at 28 and the gap between the lines of the MACD on a continuous increase. But this week started quite decently with a green candle, relative strength index going up closer to 50 at 45 and we almost got a bullish crossover in the MACD lines. Again there was quite a decent day just before earnings where the MACD lines finally crossed. But then Wednesday followed with the earnings crash relative strength index going back under 30 to 26 and 12 the moving average of the MACD going under the 26th one. As you can see I added another long trade in and we will check on those results on eToro shortly. Now as of Thursday the price is at the lows of $125.50 and both the relative strength index and the MACD are showing more weakness. So I think it would be a good idea to wait out this volatility before starting a position and maybe at least aim for that 300 day moving average average support on the weekly chart. Now let us go take a look on our performance on eToro. So these are all the open trades that we currently have. As you can find we have been faithfully buying all the way down. The worst performing position was started on October 21st where we added $100 at an opening price of $246.99 and we are now down over 49% on it and now we are again losing money on the latest trade. So that was opened on February 2nd of this year with $100 at an opening price of $131.58 and with a current price of $125 we are down for 4.8%. So overall we have $900 in at an average opening price of $195.14. This means that we are losing $322 which is a loss of 35.79% making the value of our current position at $577.72. So what do you think, would you consider buying PayPal at these levels? Share your stance and target price in a comment below. Also don't forget to support the channel and leave a thumbs up under the video. I'm holding PayPal on the public eToro portfolio, so if you would be interested to check what other positions we got then follow the first link at the top of the description. This week I've made an analysis on a large consumer electronics and entertainment company, so if you would be interested in that then click on a video that is currently on the screen. And that was it from my side, thank you for watching and I will be seeing y'all in the next one.